Hundreds of people have been pulled to safety from the Mediterranean's waters by Doctors Without Borders in five separate missions this week. The NGO brought the migrants aboard Geo Barents and is waiting for the green light to disembark at a nearby port. It comes as earlier this week the organisation Alarm Phone warned authorities and rescue vessels that several boats carrying migrants were spotted off the coast of Libya. On Friday afternoon, 103 people, including 22 children, were reportedly lifted from a wooden boat. Doctors Without Borders says 371 people could have drowned, while two other rescue ships, the Ocean Viking and Humanity One, brought another 414 migrants aboard, many of whom were exhausted and dehydrated. Meanwhile, at Cyprus's overcrowded Pornara migrant camp, tensions over a mobile phone charging cable erupted into clashes between Congolese and Nigerian residents. Three people were taken to hospital for treatment. They start to, uh, to burn the tent of each other and uh, start to throw a stone. I'm going out of the camp. I'm going to city because it takes fire in camp. We have to go out. No arrests were made, however, police used tear gas to regain control while dozens of families fled the scene. According to the International Organization for Migration, more than 29,000 people have died in their efforts to relocate to Europe since 2014.